Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at how I made this Winter Soldier arm. But before we do that, I just wanted to say real quick that I never intended on this being a YouTube video. It was always going to be a TikTok video. So that's why the little aspect ratio is weird on it. But uh, I hope you guys still enjoy the video. I'm going to do my best to make it, uh, you know, up to my standard. So enjoy the video and we'll be back at the end to talk about this guy a little bit more. But real quick before we do that, if you're not subscribed, be sure to go hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell so you don't miss future videos just like this one. Alright, I'm doing a bit of a commentary to my own video here. I'd be lying if I said this wasn't weird, but basically here you see it printing. It was a free file on Thingiverse. It was in two pieces. I laid down three coats of primer, uh, you know, the first one was light and then I gradually put it on a little heavier, you can see that here, it's called a wet coat. Ignore my pink bucket, I don't want to hear it, it's all I could find. But this is just wet sanding, I think I started at like 180 grit and you know, went to 180, 220, 400, 600. I don't remember if I went any higher than 600. Maybe I did. There was some parts of the print that were kind of not perfect. You can see it here, I'm pointing to it. And there was some on the back as well. I took a little pick in a file and I just kind of, you know, went through and detailed the lines a tiny bit. All right, now after I applied a black gloss coat, it just kind of makes your silver metallic kind of shine a little bit more. And here I kind of did the same thing I did with the primer. I did one light coat followed by one heavier wet coat. I do talk about it at the end of the video, but I went way too heavy on the last coat. I think I did one light coat and two heavy coats. I probably could have done without the last heavy coat. Mask off the star to spray paint it red. I did have to go back and look at some reference pictures because I was thinking the red was like you know, a very bright like apple red, but it was more of like a darker, not maroon, but you know, just a darker red. This is trying to glue the two pieces together with just a little bit of Gorilla Glue. I think I put like three little small drops. And here I did a terrible job showing it, but I'm basically just holding it together and here's the final product. And this is a cool little speed up thingy I did for TikTok. Notice all the cool stuff I have that goes with it. And I Agamotto, if you haven't seen that video, make sure you go watch it. All right guys, well that's about it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed the kind of behind the scenes look at how I made this uh, Winter Soldier arm. You know, like I said at the beginning, I didn't really intend to put this on YouTube, but I'm gonna because I like how it came out. I think it's really cool, but I'm also putting it on YouTube because I find that every time I do one of these 3D prints, I learn something from my own mistakes that, um, you know, maybe one of you guys can can pick up on and uh, you know not make some of the same mistakes I have and there's it's nothing big you know I think one of them is I laid down a little bit too much silver so you know there's some fingerprints and some marks from where the masking tape was when I masked off of the red and you know I sprayed too much on on the bottom arm section so it kind of I think they call it like orange peel you know stuff like that so 
but like I said, I'm learning every time that I do one of these, I'm learning a little bit more. So if you have any questions or just comments, uh, put them down in the comments and uh, please consider subscribing, hitting the notification bell and please come back to the next one. So, all right guys, see y'all later. Thank you for watching and bye.